So what's going to be in here? I'm actually kind of scared. Juness? Hell no, it isn't. I mean, we fell through a TV. Actually, uh, what is going on here? They're inside the TV? Is it some kind of portal to a different world? Is that it? So, uh, we're still alive, right? Yeah, you guys okay? Your understanding has I think increased. My butt's cracked now. Ah, always falling on your butt, getting uh, in the crack. Of course it is. Whoa. What now? Did you wet your pants? <laughs> no, stupid. Look around. Is this a studio? All this fog, or? Is it smoke? There's no place like this in Inaba, is there? Hell no. But man, this place is huge. What are we gonna do? Um. Hey, well, let's look around. Huh? But. but We're here, we look, might as well check it out. We need to get home and. Huh? Wait a minute. Wait, which way did we come in from? <laughs> Up? I don't see a way in or out. What? That can't be right. How could that be? I don't know. Don't ask me. I can't take this anymore. I want to go home. I don't blame you. So how? Okay, let's calm down. You're right. Okay. Okay. Take a breath. Let's calm down and think about this. All right. So we need to find a way out. Is there really a way out of here? We got in, so we must be able to get out somehow. That's true, but... If there's no exit, we're trapped, so let's cross our fingers and look around. Okay, so I kind of feel like the game's actually starting now. What oh, that was just kind of place? story leading up to the, uh, Feels the actual game. different from where we were before. It looks like we're in some kind of building, but... Damn, this fog's so thick I can hardly see. Are you sure we're not wandering farther away? I can't be positive, but we've got to trust our instinct question. a little. I know, but... Seems that there's no choice for now but to continue onward. Hey, is it me or is the fog lighter here? It looks to be, yeah. Looks like a comfy no bed. No service. What a surprise. Can you guys slow down a little? It's hard enough to see where you're going. Huh? What the? Whoa. It's a dead the end. There's no exit. It keeps getting creepier and creepier the further yeah, we go. Yeah, that's super creepy. Is that paint? Uh, yeah. I can't hold it any longer. I'll just find a corner, dude. My bladder's gonna explode. Yosuke, what are you doing? I gotta let it out before Yosuke. I piss my pants. You're going here? Oh, you have got to be kidding. Turn around. I can't go if everyone's watching. I can't do it. It's all your fault if my bladder bursts. Like I care. Anyways. What's hanging from the ceiling? This room. Check out these posters. 
Their faces are all cut out. Yeah, that's bizarre. One must really hate this person. Is it that person they found dead? Dude, this chair and rope, that kind of arrangement is never good. It's tied in a noose. Is this a scarf? Come on, let's go back to where we came from and look somewhere else for an exit. Hey, I think I've seen that poster before. Place. And I'm not yeah, it's gotta be that so lady good. that's found dead. That's now my bet. That you mention it, me too. Yeah, yeah. Body does feel heavy. Could it be due to this place's oppressive atmosphere? I would say right, so. Let's go back. I'm seriously starting to feel sick. Finally made it back here. Wait, what's that? There's something over there. Uh oh. What the heck? Oh, that's the guy. I've seen pictures of him. <laughs> uh. What is this thing? A monkey? A bear? What in A the world? Wobble? That's what I want to know. Who are you guys? It talked. Hmm. Well, what are you? You want to fight? <laughs> Very aggressive. Uh, don't yell at me like that. The bear is cowering in fear. Maybe it'd be better to ask him nicely. What is this place? This place is what it is. It doesn't have a name. That. It's where I live. Okay. You live here? Those body outlines? If I was you guys, Mother I'd bad. hurry back to the other side. Someone's been We're throwing trying. people in here. It's a big headache. Huh? Throwing people in? What are you talking about? Hm. I don't know who's doing it. I just want them to think before they go doing things like that. Hey, what's your problem? What gives you the right to yell at us like that? What are you? Where are we? What the heck is going on here? That bear's voice is, is so familiar. I already told you. I'll have to look up Anyways, who, you who should did the voice back. acting. Very what familiar. What it comes down to is, you want us to get out of here, right? Well, so do we. We just don't know how, damn it. Well, that's why I'm saying I'll let you out. Like I keep saying, we don't know where the frickin' exit... Wait, what? Whoa. What the hell? Where did those TVs come from? <laughs> His foot. Okay, now go, go, get out of here. I'm a busy bear. What's going on now? Whoa! Hey, what <laughs> are you doing? Stop pushing! Are we back? Crazy. Huh? Is this... Did we make it back? Looks like we did. Thanks, Mystery Bear. Attention shoppers! Our daily limited time sale will now begin at the side dish area on the first floor. Why not try the delicious fresh produce Juness picked for you this morning as your side dish for dinner tonight? All ages are invited to take advantage of this incredible bargain. Crap, it's already that late? <sighs> Looks like we were in there for quite a while. Hmm, is time different? That's right. Now I remember where I saw that poster before. Look over there. That's the poster we saw. What's up now? Hey, you're right. They're the same. I couldn't tell before without the face, but it was Misuzu Hiragi. She's been all over the news lately. Something about her husband having an affair with that announcer lady who died the other day. Hey, so does that mean that weird room we saw? 
Could it be related to that Yamano lady's death? Now that I think about it, there was that creepy noose hanging from the ceiling. Yeah, that's really weird. Yeah, stop. No more. We gotta stop talking about this. I'm gonna wipe what happened today from my brain. I don't think my poor heart can take anymore. I'm feeling a chill, too. Let's go home. I want to lie down and rest. Yeah, good idea. Hey, welcome home. You still feel sluggish. Um, well, I doubt you'd know. But have you heard anything about a student named Saki Konishi? Is that the one I met? Yeah, she discovered the body, right? Yeah, that's true. Well, to be honest, we got a call from her family. She's disappeared. Oh, crap. We've got people looking for her, but she hasn't been found yet. Yeah, that's not good. Oh. <sighs> Make sure ran away and hid. Piling up. And now, more on the case still casting a shadow over the foggy town of Inaba. Not long ago, television announcer Mayumi Yamano was found dead in the small town. Up until now, her whereabouts prior to her death had been unknown. But the police investigation has found that she had been staying in the region's famous Amagi <gasps> Inn. That's what's her name's family's inn. Yukiko's. Yeah. She had apparently been staying there alone. Perhaps she was taking a vacation to recover from her ordeal? Oh yes, the Amagi Inn. Their hot springs are first rate. The manager's <laughs> teenage daughter also works there. And it's rumored that she'll take over the inn this spring. If that happens, she'll be As one of the youngest managers on record. I should book another trip there. Uh, I see. <laughs> Moving yeah, that along, was it's time for the weather report. The rain has begun to subside. From now until morning, heavy fog warnings will be in effect in the Inaba region. Visibility will be severely reduced, so please be careful if you plan on driving in the area. The news continues. Just before the announcer was found dead, she was apparently staying at the uh, Magi Inn run by Yukiko's family. And it seems that the whereabouts of Saki Konishi, who discovered the body, are unknown. <laughs> Give Look how big those bowls are. <laughs> Ooh, sneezed. You feel a slight chill. Are you sick? You're probably still adjusting to the new environment. Nanako, could you get him some cold medicine? Yeah, thanks, Nanako. You should get to bed after you take it. That's a good idea. We'll do a quick save. She goes straight to bed tonight. A spring cold could be can be tough, indeed. Oh, already talked to you. Okay. Nanako? People are sick should stay in bed. There's fog today, so we should, you should go to sleep early or you'll catch a cold. Quiz show? There's always a quiz show, isn't there? Yeah. Kind of the same stuff. Can I go outside yet? <laughs> I told you to go to sleep. Okay, uncle. You feel sluggish. You should rest early today. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's rest. Going into Friday. Who's this? Oh, shoot. Is that the girl from school? Oh, it's kind of shocking. Jeez. Oh, you're up. Well, I'm off. Dojima left the house. Dad has to go do something. He got a call, so he left. Nanako looks worried.
You can hear girls gossiping. When I looked, I saw three police cars zooming by. You live by the police station, don't you? Did you hear anything? I heard some yelling, but nothing more. A total disappointment. Jeez, you need to pay more attention to stuff like that. How else are we supposed to get the juicy stories? Well, I live with a detective, so you hear sirens nearby. It seems there, there's been an incident. You decide to head to school. Okay, we're going into afternoon. Hey, did you see it yesterday? Of course not. What is that rumor for real? I don't know, but it seems like a lot of people have seen it. Seen what? Over here, people gossiping about something. Yukiko said she'd be here after lunch. I wonder why they're holding a school assembly all of a sudden. Hey, what's wrong, Yosuke? Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Everyone, please settle down. The school assembly is so about to begin. Fu Fue. First, the principal has something to say. I regret to say that I have a terrible announcement for all of you. That's not good, Dumbledore. One of our third year students, Ms. Saki Konishi of Class 3, has passed away. Passed away? <sighs> Ms. Konishi was found deceased mm, early this morning. Had a thing for her. The reasons behind her passing are currently under investigation by the police. If they ask you for your cooperation, I urge you as students of this school to provide only the facts. All right, please quiet down. Things are getting real. I have been assured by the faculty that there's been no evidence that bullying was involved in the incident. So mind what you say, not only to the police, but to anyone who asks. Found dead? How could this happen? <sighs> Principal's address continues. She died the same way as that announcer, right? It's so creepy. Well, last time it was from an antenna, but this time she was hanging from a telephone pole. It's gotta be a serial murder case. Someone said the cause of death was some unknown poison. Unknown? Come on, this isn't some sci-fi drama. Oh, by the way, did you hear? Someone saw a girl that looked like Saki on that midnight channel thingy. They said she totally looked like she was in pain. Isn't that scary? <laughs> Sounds like someone had a nightmare. The media's been broadcasting their interviews with her nonstop. So maybe they just had Saki on the brain. Hmm. Sheesh. It's easy to toss around theories if you're not personally involved. Yosuke. Hey, did you guys check out the TV last night? Yosuke, not you too. Just listen for a sec. Something kept bothering me, so I watched it again, and I think the girl on the screen, Saki-senpai. There's no mistaking it. Senpai looked like she was writhing in pain, and then she disappeared from the screen. What? You heard Senpai's body was found in a similar situation as that announcer's, right? Well, remember that guy you told us about? How he was all excited that his soulmate was the announcer? Maybe, just maybe, but Ms. Yamano might have been on that midnight channel before she died, too. What's that supposed to mean? Hold on. Are you saying people who appear on that TV die? I can't say for sure. But something tells me. I just can't dismiss it as coincidence. <gasps> Plus, remember what that bear thing said? <laughs> the bear thing. How that place was dangerous and we should leave before the fog clears? It also said that someone's been throwing people in there. Yeah, that's super in creepy. That room with the posters on the wall. It has to have something to do with the announcer's death. I mean, do 
Don't you think there's some kind of connection there? Couldn't that world in the TV have something to do with Senpai and the announcer's death? Well, what do you think? I don't know, Yosuke. You might be right. So it's not just me, huh? If there is a connection, then it's a good bet that the two of them went inside that world. That would explain the posters in that room. Which means, if we look around, we might find a place that has something to do with Senpai, too. <laughs> Yosuke, Are don't you suggesting me. going back in? Yeah. I'm thinking about going in again. I want to find it's out very for bold, myself. Yosuke. Don't, don't do this. You should just let the police handle this and... You think we can rely on the police? They haven't made any progress on the announcer's case. Besides, even if we told them about the world inside the TV, there's no way they're going to believe us. If I'm completely off base point. with this, Good point. that's fine. It's just... I need to know why Senpai had to die like this. Yosuke. After what I've seen and what I've put together, there's no way I can ignore it now. Sorry, but you're the only person who can help me. I'm gonna go get ready. I'll be waiting for you at Juness. Hmm. Yosuke has asked you to take him into the TV world again. I can kind of understand how he feels. But we can't be sure we'll be able to get out safely again. What should we do? Yeah, I say we go with him. You serious? Yeah. I want to find out too. Anyways, let's go to Juness. We can't leave Yosuke alone. Yeah, let's save. <laughs> Is that a giant came. golf club? We came to stop you, idiot! Come on, you really shouldn't do this. It's too dangerous. I know, but we were able to come back once, right? If we go in from the same location, maybe we'll meet that bear again. Maybe isn't good enough. Look, I can't just act like everyone else and pretend this has nothing to do with me. That's true, but... What about you? Could you just walk away? Yeah. I can't just leave yeah. it. I thought not. I'm glad to know you're that kind of guy. Don't worry, I'm not going in without a plan. Chie, I'm leaving you in charge of this. Huh? What's that? A rope? We'll go in with this tied to me. So I want you to hold on to this and wait here. What? what? Then this is a lifeline? Come on, wait a sec. It's not very long. Here, this is for you. <laughs> Sweet. Look at that golf club. Madison times three. Oh, I, I get to fight. Be I'm excited. Going empty -handed. All right, let's go. There's no use wasting any more time. Chie, whatever you do, don't let go of the rope. Hey! I said wait! Sorry, Chie. Oh, that's not good. See? I knew this wasn't going to work. Now what? <laughs> Crap. Uh, is this Look, this is the same place as last time. Well, there are so all the bodies on the floor place on that to place. Line. You guys a <laughs> mysterious back? bear. I get it. You're the ones behind this. No. You're that thing from last time. Wait, what the hell did you just say? 
Lately, I can tell someone's been throwing people in here. It's making this world more and more messed up. This is the Damn second time you guys came here, and I don't think anyone forced you in. That means you're the most suspicious. Hmm. You guys must be the ones throwing the people in here. <laughs> Very intimidating. Yeah, hell no. What are you talking about throwing people in? If someone was thrown in here and they couldn't get out, they might die. Who would do such a... Wait a sec. <gasps> what, Yosuke? Let's talk about someone throwing people in here. Does he mean Senpai and the announcer? Did that someone throw those two in here? Hey, what do you think? Yeesh. I don't know, really. I don't know. I can't say for sure either. But doesn't it bug you how this bear keeps saying someone's been throwing people in here? Let's assume he's telling the truth. Could it be that someone's throwing people in here intending to kill them? If that's the case, what are you guys mumbling about? Why'd you come here anyways? It's a one-way door. You can't get out once you're in. Remember how I had to let you guys out? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> we don't need your help this time. See, this time we have a life. Li <laughs> no idea. Hey, you better let us out once we're done investigating here. <laughs> I'm the one who wants to investigate. I've lived here for a long time, but it's never been noisy like this till now. Do you have proof? Prove to me you're not throwing people in here. <laughs> How do I do that? Yeah, it doesn't work that way. See? So it is you guys. For the last <laughs> time, it's not us. So we've got nothing to prove to you. Hey, you better answer our questions. This isn't like last time when we came by accident. We're dead serious. Listen up, because people have died in our world. Every time the fog appears, a dead body shows up with it. It has to be related to this place somehow. If you know something, tell us. A dead body? Whenever the fog appears? I know that if it's foggy on your side, the fog lifts here. Hmm. It's really dangerous That's when the weird. fog lifts. That's when the shadows get violent. Is there some kind of crossover into ah, the other world? I get it. Huh? If you get it, then explain <laughs> it to us, damn it. If it's foggy on our side, it isn't in here. Shadows get violent? That's why I said to hurry back. It's dangerous when that happens. Okay, no more questions. I know you guys did it. You better stop right now. I told you and told you we're not the ones doing it. I've about had it with you. Why the hell won't you listen to what we're saying? Uh, I'm just saying you might be the culprits. Uh, I'm just making sure. What? Man, this bear's driving me nuts. <laughs> what is this place anyways? It looks like a TV studio. Is something being filmed here? Hey, hey, don't tell me. Is that weird show being filmed here? Weird show. Weird show? Filmed? What does that mean? Uh, I'm asking if someone's been filming the people that get thrown in here. Eh, I don't get it. Yeah. This world has always been like this. No one has ever done that filming thing here. Uh, what do you mean? Only me and shadows are here. Shadows, I told you before. Yeah. We don't know what these shadow things are, or what you are either, for that matter. You keep telling us to prove our innocence, but you're the most suspicious thing here. Maybe you're the real culprit. Mm. What's with that Point stupid Yosuke. costume? I'd say it's time you showed your face. Whoa. Is he hollow? What the hell are you? It's empty inside. Was he like an empty costume? Me? The culprit? I wouldn't do such a thing. I just live here. I just want to live here peacefully. <sighs> okay, I'll believe that you guys aren't the culprits. But I want you to find the real guy who did all this. You have to stop him. Promise me. Or else... Or else.
belt, but I'm not gonna let you guys out of here. Oh. You little this can't keep going on. My home here will be a complete mess. And then and then I <laughs> oh, poor bear. What are you crying for all of a sudden? Jeez, this thing's really weirding me out. The mysterious bear is asking you to find the culprit behind this. Well, that's why we came. Someone on the outside is throwing people into this world. If the culprit isn't you, he wants you to find the real culprit. The mysterious bear seems serious about this. <sighs> hey, what should we do? You remember the words of the mysterious old man who called himself Igor? It seems you will encounter a misfortune at your destination. And a great mystery will be imposed upon you. Ah. Could this be the mystery that will be thrust upon you? I'm thinking it is. What was the contract? Oh, could finding the culprit and solving the case be part of this promise? In any case, since you cannot leave the TV world on your own, there's some. there seems to be no other option. You're the only ones I can ask. Will you promise me? Yes. I promise. We'll find out what's going on. Thank you! Damn bear. Practically holding a gun to our heads. But it's true that we came here to figure things out. So far, we're completely in the dark. Look for the culprit, huh? Bring it on. You got my word, too. Ah, Might good man, Yosuke. Ourselves. I'm Yosuke Hanamura, and this is my buddy. You got a name. Gregor Smythe. Teddy! Oh, of course. <laughs> Figures. <laughs> but how are we supposed to find the culprit in the first place? I don't know. Oh, but I know where the last person came in. The last person? You mean Saki-senpai? I mean the person who came in and disappeared last time. I don't know the name. I'll take you there. You might find clues. Oh, good. Oh, one thing first. You two should put these on. Oh, glasses? What are these glasses for? Do they see through the fog? Oh, nice. If you put on the glasses, your vision instantly becomes much clearer. Whoa. The difference is like night and day. With these on, it's like the fog doesn't exist. They'll help you walk through the fog. Well, I've been here for a long time, so you can rely on me. Uh, but I can only show you where the place is. You guys will have to defend yourselves. What okay, happened to relying enough. on you? There better not be any monsters, you understand? We brought weapons, but, I mean, they're more for show. We just got here. If it's so dangerous, why don't you do something instead of relying on us? Uh-uh. No way. I've got no muscles. <laughs> oh, oh, I'll give you guys moral support from a safe ah. distance. How's that sound? It's very helpful, Teddy. Thanks. Can Teddy really not fight? Uh, oh, I'll try touching Teddy. Duh. <laughs> Wow, a light touch and he's down. Is this thing for real? <laughs> uh, this is so lame. We swore to find the culprit and this is all the backup we get? Oh yeah, can I ask you something? Do you need help up? Who's this Saki senpai person? Someone you know? Mm -hmm. This guy had a big crush <sighs> on her. It doesn't matter right now. Poor guy. Anyways, at least now we know senpai might have been thrown in here. Maybe we can find more information too. Let's get moving. Good idea. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> <Worthless. laughs> 